Alrighty, hello guys, welcome to your faces back to another Stormworks video on my channel. Today we are actually going to be starting a brand new career mode. Now, as you guys can see, we are actually going to have the weapons DLC enabled. Uh, and we're also actually going to have literally everything else enabled except from the tutorial, because I don't really want to deal with that. Uh, but what this means is that we will actually have to defend ourselves from the AI. We'll have to capture AI islands. We'll also have to make money and rescue people at the same time. It's going to be kind of crazy, so um, yeah, let's go ahead and start with the starter base. Today we'll build a starter boat and uh, yeah, we'll get on with it from there. Let's go! Okie dokie, so the weather actually always starts off like this. It always gets very, very... Should we leave this on? I think we should leave this on. Uh, so the weather actually gets very, very um, rainy and wavy to begin with, and I don't know why that's the case, but it always is. You don't really get a chance to um, go out in your boat before it gets wavy. It's always wavy. But anyway, let's go ahead and start building something that hopefully looks quite cool, uh, works quite well, and um, yeah, is just genuinely quite good. We're going to go ahead and get rid of these machine guns for right now. We will need machine guns, uh, because if we do get attacked, we need something def to defend ourselves with. Machine guns will work, I guess. Okie dokie, so let's go ahead and move this thing forwards and we'll start building from here. So I'm thinking a catamaran would actually be pretty good. So let's go out about, I don't know, that much. There we go. And then we'll start extending it forwards and hopefully all will go well from there. So let's do this down four and that will allow us to actually use um, extra parts, if that makes sense. So we're actually going to go ahead and start with these guys. Uh, and it's actually going to start all the way down here, which uh, is a bit weird, but it works. So there we go, we'll do something like that, which is epic. We'll then put one of these guys on. There we go, excellent. Put one of these guys on, and then we'll have it go backwards, and everything should be fine. So attach this directly under there. Excellent. Go ahead and attach this directly onto here. Excellent as well. And drag this out sideways, like so. Yes. All right, and that's exactly what we want. Send this backwards from there. And that is the shape that we actually want to go with. We're going to go ahead and fill in all of these sections. Excellent. Uh, and we're going to fill them all in so that they all work. The top side is actually going to be flat, so that's okay. There we go. Go ahead and put that in there like that. Go ahead and put this guy on here as well. Excellent. And then this piece as well, and we should be good to go. Yeah, that works. It's a little bit small, but I think it'll be fine. All right, so with that being said, can we actually delete this one and put in one of these? And will it look okay? Is the question. So there we go. If we put that on there like that, and we put this guy right here, I guess that will actually look fine. Uh, and it does actually look A-OK. -okay. Good. Yes. All right, seal all of this together, like so. Uh, I feel like we should actually do this backwards. There we go. So it's going to be like that. Excellent. Uh, the floor is obviously going to go up here. That's really good. And we're going to attach all of this together. There we go. Nice. Okay, I guess that totally works. It does totally work. That's good. All right, so actually, instead of using this bit right here, we're going to delete all of this. Uh, we'll delete all of this for right now as well. Uh, and I think we'll actually do the same thing that we've done on the other side like this. Uh, we'll actually send it all the way backwards with that. There we go. Just like this. All right, excellent. Bring this out to here. Go ahead and put this guy right there. And I feel like that actually looks pretty good for our boat. Yeah, for our experience, this is going to be excellent. Um, shall we leave this flat is the question. I'm not sure. I don't know whether we should leave that flat. I really don't know. But for now, I'm actually going to uh, because reasons. We're, we're going to leave that flat. That's okay. Uh, right. Let's go backwards from there and see what we can actually do from here. So put these two on there. Excellent. Uh, and we're actually going to go ahead and angle this backwards uh, like we can. There we go. Uh, and we're going to go down two. There we go. That's very nice. Uh, and we should be able to just put the extra pieces on there. Uh, and it should look sick, to be honest. It should actually look pretty good. So, go from here, upwards, go from there, upwards as well. Do the same thing on the other side, up to there, do this piece as well, and hopefully all will go well. Excellent. Yeah, this will work. Okay, so this is where things get a little bit annoying, or a little bit sag. Uh, essentially, because I'm making this look like I am, where it's so pointy at the bottom, we're going to have issues with balance, except from the fact that we actually have two pontoons. So maybe it should be fine. But in this game, if you have a flat bottom on your boat, you are probably going to be okay. If you have a pointy bottom on your boat, you're probably not going to be okay. But because we've got two pontoons, 
I think it'll level itself out. I think this will be fine. Okie dokie. So with all that being said, we are actually going to go ahead and grab this from here all the way down to the bottom. There we go. Excellent. We're going to send it all the way across and including this side. There we go. Go ahead and copy this. Move it backwards. And I think we'll paste it right there. Excellent. Merge this with this. That's very nice. Uh, and I think the back of this boat is just going to be pretty flat. I, I don't think there's going to be very much to it. So um, what we could do is have some stairs on both sides. And I think that'll be okay. Uh, but let's go ahead and do something pointy to begin with. All right, so we're going to do uh, this. There we go. So that's going to go up there like that. We're going to do this bit as well. All right, excellent. And then if we want to, we'll just put this piece on here. Ladders on the back end of that, and we should be good to go. All right, all the way up to there. Excellent. So we need to delete that one, delete this one, and attach the rest of them together. There we go. Brilliant. I mean, this is looking pretty good, I would say. Uh, we're then going to attach this guy to here, because we can, uh, and we're actually going to send this downwards, and hopefully that will work. Alright, there we go, do that, delete this guy, excellent, do the same as this one, on over here, bam, delete that guy, and seal all of this off and we should be good to go. Yeah, this is actually excellent, it will totally work. Uh, grab this guy at the front, go ahead and put it right here, hold on, where is it, there it is, okay, excellent. Uh, and then do the same thing right here as well. So whack that on. Go ahead and fill this in. And there we go. We got ourselves a hole. Um, and that should float and should work. There we go. Let's have a little look at this. Why is it sank? <laughs> what? How is it sinking? There's no way this should be sinking. Oh, because there's a hole in it. How is it floating? That's my other question. All right, put this right here. There we go. Excellent. Spawn it in. And now it should float really well. Yes. Excellent. This is really good. All right, okay, so this is all excellent and it all does actually work. Now we need to build some sort of bridge for this thing, and I'm not entirely sure how I want it to look, to be totally honest with you. Uh, I feel like these bits should actually come up one more, so let's do that uh, to start with. There we go, we'll do something like this. We'll then do it on the other side as well, from there forwards, and we'll attach all of it together at the front. So like this, and like this. Excellent. And I think we'll send it all the way down the back, like so. Delete these guys. Uh, in fact, two more. And I feel like adding this piece right here like that, and then one of these guys right here like this, will actually make it look a little bit better. And I think it does. Okay, now we're going to attach these guys together. So we're actually going to go ahead and put this here like this, and we're going to send that across there. And I feel like that does actually look pretty excellent. I think that works. Uh, we're also going to delete this guy. We need to get ourselves a winch. Uh, and I feel like this is actually going to go on the bottom. I've got to remember, though... I do actually have to remember that I have a money issue uh, where we actually need to spend quite a lot of money to get this thing moving uh, and then we need to keep some money in order for it to actually work out for me. So, yeah. I don't know whether we should have the winch yet or not. I think I might keep it. We'll keep it for now. Okay, so now for the engine, we're actually going to go ahead and use two medium ones and I'm actually going to put them somewhat in the middle. So, we're going to turn this around and we're going to put it right about here. Okay, excellent. That moves it backwards and down. That's fine. As long as the fuel tank and stuff are at the front, we can balance it out. And in fact, because I've said that, we'll actually move this backwards a little bit more. There we go. As long as we can fit a gearbox and a clutch in here, that's fine. Uh, we need the air supply to be able to go out the top as well. And then we need the fuel, the coolant, and everything like that to work as well. Uh, and that should be fine. Okay, excellent. This is fine. This is, this is okay, I think. Alright, so before we actually get any further, I'm going to paint this thing a different colour. We're going to go with this yellow. Actually, no, we're going to go with this gold. Gold colour all the way around the outside. Uh, yes, okay, excellent. And I want this thing to look good as well as work well. So hopefully this works. <laughs> hopefully this does actually work. There we go, do all of this. Alright, but obviously don't do the top bit. There we go. Uh, and that actually looks okay so far. That actually looks pretty good. Uh, we'll do the deck colour this colour, like I always do. And that looks pretty sick, to be fair. And then all of the white colour can actually be changed into a dark colour like this. I don't know, does that look okay? Maybe not. I think it, maybe it should be white. I don't know. I don't actually know. Alright, paint these guys. I'm actually thinking maybe we should use the lighter yellow. Yes. Uh, and we'll go with that. That looks cool. It does, it looks cool. Okay, so now we actually have to try and build a bridge onto this thing. I'm going to leave a little bit of room at the front. Actually, maybe I shouldn't. Maybe the actual bridge should start here. 
I don't know. I don't know. Let me look at some pictures of catamarans and I'll see what, what I want to do. Okay, so uh, this is a little bit weird. I'm not entirely sure it's still where I want it to go, um, but I am thinking about this and I feel like these two should be deleted and we should actually send this across there instead, uh, which gives us a little bit more room back here. Uh, and this looks a little bit strange, but we can go with it. We can then delete this guy and I feel like we should actually get away with doing uh, something like this. All right, so if we put that on there and then we put some... One by twos right here. This should actually look sick. Yeah, that works. That looks nice. Yeah. Okay, so I'm thinking maybe instead of doing one where we're actually at the same level as everyone else, maybe we should actually put it in the air a little bit. So let's go ahead and do this uh, to a point where the door would reach. <laughs> this is my this is my um, standard for how tall things should be. Uh, we're going to go up probably one more from there then. Okay, so bring this up one more. There we go, like this. Uh, and honestly, the floor should actually go in here. Okay, excellent. And I feel like that's actually way too tall. It looks like it would be crazy tall, actually. Let's not do that. It's going to be a single story one instead. So realistically, we can actually start here. Let's go ahead and um, start building it in, shall we? I don't know how this is going to work, to be honest. I don't know how this is going to work. So I feel like we should actually make the bridge out of pieces like this to begin with. So we need. We need to know, like, how big or where it's going to go, if that makes sense. So if the bridge goes somewhere like this, that would be fine. Okay, let's go ahead and put this piece in as well. We'll build the walls as if they are this thick. That makes sense. And then we need to go up probably one more. Okay, so do this backwards. Excellent. And then we'll go across again, like so. Excellent. And attach it together. Bam. All right, cool. I think this gives us enough room for what we need. And now, pyramids! Let's go! Alright, I don't know how I'm going to get the windows onto this thing. I'm not going to lie. The windows are going to be a pain in the butt. But let's see how this goes. So send this forwards like so. Delete that guy right there. How do I attach these two together? So we delete this and we do this. Alright, excellent. And then I think, I think we put these in. There we go. One there. And then one there. Okay, yeah, no, this works. And then we send this backwards across the top like this. And then we do something back here, which I don't know what we do back here. What do we do back here? What, what do I do with this? Like that. There we go. All right. That actually looks excellent. Good. Uh, we're then going to fill this in like so. We're going to do this backwards. Okay, right there. And then we're going to actually grab these guys and send it backwards from there. Okay, bam. Right. Excellent. Excellent. Do we like it is the question. Do we actually, do we actually like it? I don't know. I, I genuinely don't know. I think so. All right, go ahead and put this guy back on there like that. There we go. Excellent. Fill this in at the front. And there we go. All right. I think that's pretty sick. I think it works. Yeah. All right. So now it's time for windows. Uh, this is where things are going to get very complicated because I don't know what to use here. Uh, yeah, I don't know what we should use at all. But let's say we wanted to use something like this. That actually doesn't look too, too bad. In fact, it actually looks all right. Um, as long as I can get it in the right place. So, let's build up from here. And we'll try and build it into the right area. And if we can get it in the right area completely, that would be amazing. So, we're going to use this window. And we're going to put it on there. Uh, ooh. Like this. Yeah, I feel like this could work. Delete these guys right here in the middle. Okay, delete the ones that are angled right there. Put that in, put that in, and do this. There. And now it fits. I mean, the window actually fits in there. We'll then paint it this color. Actually, we'll paint it black. And then we should be able to fit the other windows onto there. Maybe. I don't know. Is this going to look weird in the end? I'm not sure. I'm not so sure about this, guys. I don't know. All right. Put this on here. I can't. I can't. Oh, I hate these windows. All right, there we go. Put that on there like that. Looks a bit strange, I think. But will it work? Who knows? Sure, maybe, possibly. I don't know. All right, fill this in. Like so, and maybe it will, maybe it won't. I don't like it. I don't think I like it. What if we did it outwards, though? That actually looks pretty sick, to be fair. I actually really like the way that looks. So we're going to try it outwards, and then I think if we attach this guy in the middle, 
We can actually have like a flat area at the top and that should look fine too. Possibly. There we go. And then we need to find something that will go along the length of this. Yikes. Okay, so probably one of these. But honestly, it's... Is it long enough? It is. Ooh. You know what? We'll go with it. There we go. Looks pretty sick. Kind of weird, but I like it. Uh, and then we need the rest of them to actually work as well. So, uh, it's still this one. I do believe. So, if we can put this on, that'd be great. I don't know how. <laughs> I genuinely don't know how to put this thing on so that it fits. But there must be a way. Alright, here we go. Really? There's no way it's here. My brain can't comprehend these things. But there you go, it's in. Alright, excellent. So now we've got a window there. We need a single window right here at the top. Like this. And then we need a single angled window right here. And we have a pretty cool looking bridge. I actually really like that. It looks sick. Kind of feel like it should go up another one though. And if it does go up another one, then is that going to look weird? Quite possibly. I think it might look kind of strange. Uh, actually, it might look a little bit weird. Maybe. I don't know. Yeah, possibly. I don't know. Does that look weird to you guys? I'm not entirely sure. Uh, but anyway, if we attach this onto... Hmm. I would want to do this a different way. So I'd actually want to do it like this. So we'd actually put this guy on the top of there. It would be white. Excellent. And then I think if we use these guys, all right, kind of like this, we should be good to go. Or is that too much? Is that too much? I don't know. <laughs> I genuinely don't know what I should do with this. I have no idea. That It looks cool, but I'm not sure. We're going to go with one high. We are going to go with one high just like this. Uh, let's go ahead and put the west rest of the windows in. Uh, and we should be good to go. So here we go. Windows, where are they? Windows, yes. Okay, we're going to grab this guy. And I think we're just going to whack it on the window right here on the bottom. It's going to be angled down backwards. There we go, that's fine. We're going to get two by threes. There we go, put that there and there. And that's fine. Yeah, I think this looks sick. Okay, so I think I do actually want an overhang. Uh, so what we'll do is we'll actually build this in backwards. We will use one of these guys, alright, on there like that. I don't know whether we should have the middle be that big, or whether we should have it be bigger. Because that actually works too. And then I think if we send it backwards using these guys again. Okay, so this, going backwards like that. There we go. Delete this guy, and we put this one on. We have a tiny bit of an overhang on the edge, and that should look cool. Yeah, like that. There we go. That should actually look pretty cool. I think it does. Yeah, it looks alright. It looks okay. Uh, we'll seal this off all together. Like so. And we have ourselves a catamaran bridge thing. And a boat. This is cool. This is cool. I'm not gonna lie though, it is actually a very tall boat. It is, it is extremely tall for what it is. Uh, I feel like I'm gonna go ahead and draw a water line around the outside. It's not actually the water line though, because the water's not gonna come up this high. But... I think it works for what it is, so we will. There we go. Uh, and there we go. That still looks sick. It actually looks pretty good to me. I like this. We can still get around the sides uh, if we need to. I'm going to go ahead and box this off on the back. We'll literally just do this. Uh, and we'll seal it together from here, I guess. So this is going to go across a little bit backwards if we can. So have it go out this way. Alright, excellent. It's not going to go out that much, though. It's just going to do a few, and then go this way. Attach onto that. Excellent. Do this as well. Alright, very nice. Uh, and that's all good. Excellent. Guys, we got this. Drag it down. Okay. Go ahead and get ourselves a door. And whack it in. Alright, sliding door. Uh, Put it on there like this. It is off to one side, but that's fine. And there we go. Get ourselves a bridge. That's sick. The bridge looks way too big for the boat, but I'm sure it's fine. <laughs> I'm sure it's okay. Let's have a little look at this. Yeah, uh, yeah, we could get this to work. We can actually get this to work. It looks way too big though, doesn't it? That is a big bridge. That is a big old bridge. Maybe this bit should be a little bit smaller. Or maybe the boat should be bigger. We're gonna roll with it for now. We're rolling with it. I don't care. Okie dokie, so now I think we actually need to figure out where the propeller's gonna go, because honestly, if we have the propeller right here next to the ladder, that is a death wish. Uh, we will die. 
Uh, so we probably don't want it there exactly. Uh, I'm actually thinking maybe we put it on the bottom. Uh, it's a bad idea to put a propeller on the bottom because it launches up into the sky. But with that being said, maybe it's okay. But maybe it's not. Who knows? All right, I'm going to have it slightly hidden. So the way we're going to do it, we're going to get a propeller. Okay, kind of like this one. We're going to go ahead and put it on here inwards just a little bit. There we go, like that. And we're going to seal it at the front like this. And there we go. So now uh, it's a little bit hidden. Um, we're going to paint it all dark colors down here. We're not going to paint it yellow. Uh, and that's going to work out for us. Yeah. So now the propellers are actually slightly hidden, which is excellent. Uh, they can't actually go up there, which sucks. So I'm going to have to move this a little bit. Move the engines just a tiny touch away from here. There we go. We're going to go with this. Excellent. Uh, we should be able to bring this up. Pipe. Here we go. And put that in there like this. Excellent. Make it go backwards. And then make it go upwards, presumably. Or, actually, make it go upwards from here. There you go. So we can put the gearbox in and also the clutch. I think that makes sense. Yeah. But there you go. That's what it'll look like. So our propeller's down there. It's actually a little bit out of the way. So if we do climb the ladder, I don't think we'll be able to damage ourselves, which is excellent. Uh, and that should work out for us. Good. All right, let's work out the rest of it. We need a heat uh, radiator thingamabobby. We're going to go with one of these electric radiators. That's fine. Uh, we're going to make it white and we're going to put it right there. Excellent. We're going to get some pipes. We're going to attach these together straight away. Okay, so this is going to go on here. Like that, and like that. Excellent. We need the exhaust to go out somewhere. I'm not entirely sure where this should go out, to be fair. Uh, for now, we'll just make it go up. There we go. Make it go up like this. And delete this one real quick. Okay, put that there. Um, yeah. <laughs> okay, right. Put this in here, put this in here. So that's where the exhaust actually going to come out at the minute. Uh, it will change. It will change. Let me just paint this real quick. There we go. So what I'm thinking is we actually add the uh, smokestacks to the back of this. I think that'll be pretty sick. Uh, but for now, we need to test if the engine will actually work. So let's do that. Fluid pots. Let's go. Where are they? Fluid pots. Here we go. Put that on there and on there. So that's the exhaust. Our fuel situation is just going to go forwards. We're going to get one of these guys. We're going to put it... Well, actually, I'll put it down here somewhere. The fuel is going to be a little bit lower, uh, so that we're a little bit more stable in the water. That works. All right, there we go. So bring it down, bring it this way, and then put a thing on it. Here we go. Excellent. Bam. All right, and now what I'm thinking is we do this. We do this. And we do this backwards to there. All right, delete these guys. And then I think we just attach these to here. Oh, wow. No, actually, what's the easiest or best way of doing this? I'm thinking these guys down the sides. There we go. Down this side as well as a little barrier. Okay, and then we just seal it up. There we go. Seal this up. Seal this up as well. And then along the top, I don't know. Hold on. Bam, bam. We just have to do this, uh, but the right way up. There we go. Like that. All the way down there. Excellent. Do this one all the way down here. Excellent as well. And now we need a meter. Uh, like this one. There we go. A meter. And we also need a spawner. And then we should be good. Here we go. Yeah. Spawner and a meter. Very good. There we go. Excellent. And that should all work out fine. We now need an air supply. And that's it. So bring this out sideways. Bring it backwards. Uh, bring it actually backwards. There we go. And then make it go up from there. If we can. There we go. Excellent. And make it go up. Delete this. Have the have it come out of here. That's fine. Attach under there. Excellent. So that's our air supply. Our exhaust. Um, our fuel is done. Now we just need to attach this to a gearbox and then a clutch. Gearbox. There we go. Alright, so that's going to go in there like this. Excellent. The clutch is going to go on the top of that. Like so. And then we're going to all attach it all together just like this. Should be easy peasy, actually. There we go. Bring it down. And then take it in. There we go. Nice. All right. And then finally, we need a battery. So the battery is actually going to be a big one. And it's going to go right at the back. 
on the outside. Okay, there we go. So now we've got two batteries, we've got two engines, we've got two fuel tanks, we've got two clutches, we have um, two radiators. Okay, so there's a lot going on here, to be fair, but I'm sure it's fine. Attach all of this to each other, and then to there. Good. Is it going to work? Who knows? Okie dokie, so Helm is in. Let's see if all of this will work, shall we? So one goes to here, it also goes to here, that starts both of those. Uh, we also need two to go to this and this to actually turn on our radiators. Excellent. We need the throttle to go to up and down. There we go. Up and down. Excellent. We need the clutch to go to W and S. Uh, there we go. W and S and W and S. And then we also need a rudder that allows us to actually steer this thing. Unfortunately, that's a pain in the butt, actually. So, we don't have any room for a rudder. Not really. Unless we delete this ladder. I guess that's fine, actually. We could delete the ladder. Yeah. Alright, because we still got two ladders. So it's actually completely fine deleting that. Alright, cool. Only put this in on this side like so. Put it in on this side like so as well. And there we go, we got rudders. Excellent. Let's attach those to A and D. There we go. Let's have up and down be on sticky. And that should be it. That should be literally all we need. That should be all we need. We need a reverse gear, though, as well, to be fair. So, let's put this ratio off, ratio on. Okay, ratio off. I think they can actually be 3 to 1. And then, yeah, okay. Uh, and that's going to go on 3. And that's going to be our reverse. There we go. And on 3 again, reverse. Excellent. Right, we're not going to do anything with the winch as of right now. But this is fine. Okay, it's very low in the water, I'm not going to lie. But let's see if it works. Alright, so, press 1. All right, and there we go. That's the problem with having your uh, <laughs> with having your propeller all the way at the bottom. If you are too fast, you will just flip over. That's not excellent. That's really not good, actually. Uh, we will delete some of these as we go along. So we'll delete that one, that one, and that one. We'll also delete this one, this one, and this one. And we'll have rudders, no control surfaces, on those. So this is going to go here like this. And it's also going to go here like this. And I don't know if it's going to actually save it or not, but let's try, shall we? Let's try. There we go. Put all of that in there, because otherwise we'll sink. And do that as well. There we go. Excellent. Right, so now we need to paint all of these on the outside. There we go. Paint all of this on the outside as well. And there we go. We should be a little bit more stable in the water now as well, which is fantastic. Um, I'm also going to put some pivots in. Just to make us a little bit more buoyant, which would be fine. Let's make them white so they fit in a little bit. There we go, and there we go, and there we go, and there we go. Okay, spawn it in, let's see what happens. That's weird. I don't know why it's doing that, but sure. I don't have any steering capabilities, because they're not connected to the electricity. There we go, so connect those to the electricity. And now we should be good. Come on, try it one more time. I don't know what it's doing at the start, that's really weird. The fact that it's just rolling over like that's strange. Right, here we go. It's got a really weird roll to it, I don't know why that's happening. It might be due to these guys. We'll get rid of these again. Alright, get rid of those guys. And don't roll this time, please. No, it's still doing it. What's happening there? Why is it doing that? Okay, so I'm really not sure what's going on with this boat. It seems a bit weird, to be totally honest with you guys. I don't know why it's doing what it's doing, so that's very strange. Uh, what we will do is we'll delete all of these. We'll get some weight, and we will actually just whack in a bunch of weight. This is going to be a lot, actually. Uh, and that means that the weight is actually going to come down from being higher to lower, and that makes sense. I don't know why the weight is actually so high as it stands, because uh, we've actually got our fuel tanks in here, right? Our fuel tanks are actually down here. Um, I don't know. I don't know. It seems a bit strange. It seems really, really weird. But anyway, let's go ahead and try it again. Press 1. Now it's not working at all. I broke it. 
Okay, right, I see why it's acting a bit weird now. It's because we don't actually have these things on both sides for some reason. I wasn't actually doing it on both sides. Also, is the weight not on both sides? Yes, okay, right. Now I know exactly why uh, it's not working the way that I wanted it to. Interesting. That's so weird. I, I, that is really, really weird. But anyway, let's go ahead and do this all the way down the end. There we go, like this. Excellent. Uh, we're then going to go ahead and copy this side, so we need these guys, if we can. There we go. All of those, and all of these ones as well. There we go. Go ahead and copy those. Take it to the other side. They don't have any electricity or anything like that. It doesn't matter. But let's go ahead and put those on there. Paste them. Very good. Merge them in. So merge this. Oh, wait. Wait, they're in the wrong place. They got put in the wrong place, I feel. No, maybe they're not. Maybe they're in the right place. All right, paste it there. Merge it together. Here we go. Merge this with this. Excellent. And put a roof on it. Hold on. Ah! There we go. Put a roof on there. Excellent. Go to the other side and do the same thing wherever they are. Where are they? There they are at the front. There we go. Put these on. Excellent. And paint everything the same color. There we go. All right, so. There we go. Everything's getting painted. Everything's going to work. This is such a long video as well. If you guys have made it to this point, I don't know how you've done it, but there you go. Anyway, there we go. Paint that bit. Paint that bit. Uh, paint all of this bit at the back. There we go. Including these. And that one. There we go. And all of this. Woohoo! Okay, it's all painted. We've, we've done a lot. Go! Does it work now? Does it tip over when it starts? No. Doesn't tip over from the start. That's excellent. It does, however, fly. <laughs> it flies a little bit. Look at this. It's in the air. It's totally in the air. Alright, that's not really what we want from our boat. We don't want it to fly. Not really. Alright, we're going to go backwards. Uh, and we're going to try and get into uh, an area where we can grab it. There we go. Excellent. Uh, and the thing that I think we want to do is we'll put the pivots back in. Alright, we still have enough money for this. So robotic pivot, we'll put it right there. And right there. And right here. And also right here. That's on both sides. Let's see how high in the water it is now. Not. It's just not very high in the water. What the heck? Come on. Go higher. Go higher in the water. This is all we need. This is all we need. You just need it to go higher. Alright, spawn it up in the air a little bit. Now go. There we go. It sinks a little bit, but it might be okay. Alright, let's go. Come on. Alright, we can't have it diving into the air. We can't have this being a thing. We, yeah, I really don't want it to be a dolphin boat. We'll have to fix that. But honestly, the way that it looks, I think it's pretty good. I think this works. I honestly think this works. Yeah, we'll keep it. However, I guess there is a few problems that I do have with it. I feel like the bridge is just a little bit too large for the actual boat itself. So we might change that a little bit. Uh, and make it a little bit smaller, but honestly, maybe if we make the boat a little bit larger as well, that would work out too. Um, the glass, honestly, I feel like we've done a good job with this. If I did make the bridge smaller, then this bit of glass right here would just be smaller, and that's it. Uh, as well as that one, and we'd make it a little bit skinnier. And then in that situation, I think we'd be fine. So, if you guys want to see that, let me know in the comments down below, and we'll see what we can do. Uh, I want to add the funnels to the edge of the bridge, because I feel like that would look really, really good. Uh, we need the ad to add the air supply on little pillars, probably on the side. We'll make them a little bit higher. Uh, and I think that would be sick. We need the large winch to work and everything else will be fine. That's excellent. That's actually super cool. But anyway, for a rescue boat, this is actually looking pretty good. Uh, and then for something to be upgraded into a warship <laughs> or a little war boat, I think it would actually work out too. So, yeah. Anyway, for right now, I'm going to end this video here. Thanks for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed it. And I guess I'll see you guys in the next one if you guys want to see more. But anyway, thanks for watching. See you next time. Goodbye.